here, everybody. Blue Boy 10,000 slash Poker's Elm here, bringing you another episode of Dread Sky Isles. Dread Sky Isles episode 18. And we are finishing this dungeon today. We are going to destroy these silverfish, and we are going to break them and make them bend to our every will. Oh, come on, die already. Okay, you are going to die. You're going to die. They're still coming. I don't even understand how there can be that many. This is nuts. All right. I'm just going to have to keep running. I'm going to have to, at some point, just run. Run it. Walk it. Walk it, even? Yeah, let's walk it. Sure, walking. Walking's fine, too. Probably get me to the same area no matter what, so... Please don't be a dead end. Oh, Christ. Oh, there's a big area. Does this mean what I think it means? Get away from me, you douche is. Mm. I am blocking myself in this place. You cannot get me. I have got the wall. Hallelujah. All right, what could be down here? I do not know. I have no clue. Oh my god, at least I've made it through this damn dungeon. Now it's a case of getting out. That's gonna be a problem. Okay, so what I'm gonna need to do is I'm gonna need to put this regen and the splash potion to very good use. And maybe a golden apple or two. Firstly. Surveying the surroundings, there are lots of silverfish. Spawners and not. My best option would be to s pillar myself back up. That's a cave spider. That means they spawn, which means I want to leave this place as soon as possible. And silverfish are spawning and falling. Alright, my plan will be to get into that hole there. And from there, we will begin our ascent. Oh, come on. I just dealt with all of you guys. Now I have to deal with you again? Christ. Get lost. Go. Leave. There. You can't hit me now. Okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to eat myself a nice steak. Oh, you can jump at me. You're so cute, though. That's the problem. You're just so freaking cute. Ugh. Nope, not happening, not happening, not happening. No, 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 no. Oh, that cuteness is just... It's too cute. It's just too much. Oh, oh Christ. Oh, Christ. Oh, Christ. They want, they want me down there. They don't want me to stay down there. I'm not staying down there. I'm not freaking going down there, no. Uh, I need sandstone. That's good. I need it. I need it now. Build, build, freaking build, 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 build. Go, 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 go. Oh Christ, oh Christ. Okay, we need to get out, we need to get out. We really need to get out now. Uh, let's see if we can find a way back to where we were and we can try and climb up the way we came. Oh, climbing, 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 climbing. Get away, get away, get away, come on. Okay, gotta get you, gotta get you all down. Gotta kill you all first. Mm. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. I died! Oh Christ, that's, it's starting. It's starting, guys. I don't even want to stick around to face them, I just want to get out. Get out fast. I don't even care if they spawn from an actual spawner, or if they're spawning from the walls, or whatever. I just need to get out. I need to get out as far- Get away from me, get away from me, get away from me, get away from me, get away from me. Oh my god. Mm. Oh god, I can't get up from here. Oh god, you know what I'm gonna have to do? I'm actually gonna have to dig my way out. All right, dig, 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 dig. I'll dig my way out. I will dig my way to freedom. 
Freedom. Freedom. Freedom. Freedom. Come on, we can't. Okay, come on. This is getting a bit ridiculous now. Okay. I should have done this originally. I probably would have been a better idea. I'll use my apple to try and get some good regen going. I would have eaten the apple, but I didn't have the time. That's the problem. I think we're going to end up underneath the water. Oh my god, come on. We can't have been that far in. I think we must be underneath the water then. Or something along those lines, because we must have gone pretty damn far down. I have no idea where we are now. I literally, like, we could be digging on forever. I mean, eventually we're going to have to hit something, so... As long, as long as we keep going up. Let's check, where are we on F3? We are at Y equals 104 going up. Yeah, right. So, why have we not found anywhere yet? Dirt, that means underwater. Oh boy. Okay, okay. Okay, please don't tell me I'm going to dig up where mycelium is. Oh god. I'm terrified I'm going to dig up right underneath one of those mushrooms that I hadn't cleared. Come on. Please. Come on. I'm waiting on you. Seriously, how far do we go down? I don't even know where we are now. I... Even if I wanted to, I wouldn't be able to tell you. We've just gone that far. Do we have a shovel? No, we do not. Oh my goodness. We're 121 at this point. I do not know whether this is going to work or not. I mean, it might. <laughs> What I'll do is I'll save and quit the title, and I'll spawn back in, and I'll see if we can see through the walls in that brief chunk of... There was a skeleton. I saw a skeleton. We should be fine. I saw a skeleton. Okay. Let's just dig up a bit further. I feel we're going to get out at some point soon, maybe. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh. Ha ha. Oh god, no. No. Oh no. But we made it. We dug straight back out. I'm leaving. I'm not coming back here ever again. Oh. Armpit of the world, my arse. You're gone. You're done. Done. It's done. Everyone, it's done. Yes. Whew. So we died. So I went back to where we were. We managed to escape via a very long tunnel, and we are now officially the proud owners of the Green Wall. I hope that is legit what I did going back and just making making up for the fact that it was keep inventory. Uh, Matt Maker, if you aren't happy with what I'm doing in that sense, uh, that's fine. Uh, it's how I'm playing it, though. Apologies, since it isn't obviously what you intended, but... Um, the second uh, map of uh, Tales of Dread Sky, Dread Sky Depths, uh, when that one comes out, I'll be playing that one completely legit, keep inventory off. That, I'm, that's a promise. Alright. Let's head back to the monument. Whew. Isle of Tranquility. Oh my god, if I see another silverfish, I'm gonna die. I mean, I was expecting that dungeon to be much worse. I was expecting there to be more spiders in the tunnels than silverfish, honestly. Which was why I was kind of afraid and hesitant to go in them until the end. But I mean, it's not tough. It's just if the silverfish gang up on you and you don't have the best armor, it can be problematic. But that's a completely different thing compared to tough. Why did I come up here again? Uh, I actually don't know. So what we'll do is we'll place the wool in the wool box. Okay, there we go. And we will name our lovely area that it comes from, which is the armpit of the world. Silverfish 
tunnels. That's basically what it is. And lastly, we've got the red wall, the black wall, and the emerald block. So, basically, two dungeons, and emeralds in one of those two dungeons. Oh, that's going to be so exciting. Oh, my God. We're so close to finishing this map. I am stoked for it. I'm absolutely stoked. So, we've actually only been going for 13 minutes. So, I can actually start working on going to the next area. I'm not sure if I'm going to need all of this building stuff. So, I'm going to put a whole bunch of this in there. And I'm just going to... Take this, this, this. Uh, every, anything we actually feel we will definitely need. I'll re-enchant my diamond sword, get this out so we can enchant our bow with infinity, which will be very useful. Uh, should I go for my own bow? Hmm. Because Shvangel's a good bow, but I could probably get power on it. Screw it, let's just freaking do this. Wait, no, why am I doing this? No, I want to enchant, actually. Uh, four. Unbreaking. That was useless. Oh my god. Alright, Anvil. That's what I wanted. Uh, <laughs> and Jim, in Infinity, and you. There you go. Six. Svenjol. Nice. Uh, and let's see, what else did we actually get from those enchantment books? We got protection. We got a lot of protection, which we can actually put this onto our chest plate if we really want to, because I feel like Protection 4 on our chest plate would be really good. We don't even have 7. We only have 3. Jeez. Christ. Okay, so we'll work on that for the next uh, part. So, okay. Put all these mushrooms away. We don't need them. And the string away. And the spider eye away. And the rotten flesh away. I think this is all we're going to need for the next area. We're going to need an arrow. I know we need an arrow. Don't argue with me. I know I need an arrow. Don't you tell me I need an arrow. I know I need an arrow. I need an arrow. I know I need the arrow. But I don't have anything to make arrows with. So I'm just going to have to hope there are skeletons. It's pretty simple. Because I've got the infinity bow now. So it's just a case of getting some, like, stuff. So... What we're going to do now is we are going to head to the Down Under level, Gorma the Neverack, uh, Tumble Down Under, which is obviously named after Australia. I wonder why. <laughs> and we're just going to continue on for the Red Wall. Hopefully we'll be able to find the Palm of Flame at some point, because that thing, I don't know whether I've missed it or not. I feel I may have missed it. Um... That might be, like, the only thing I will definitely have to end up looking up in the end, just because I have no idea where it is. I would have expected to have found it by now. Uh, I mean, Palm of Flame 2... Palm of Flame 3 was probably in... I'd assume it was probably in that bloody untapped underpass and that bit of the tunnel I didn't explore because I didn't want to. I swear, if it's there, I'm going to cry. All right, there's a crane. I see a crane. I don't know why I see a crane, but I see one. Uh, interesting. I've just realized we do not we do not want Swarm Crusher for this, because it's Bane of Arthropods. Oh Christ. You know what, we're gonna have to You know what, screw it, let's go in and see what like weapons they give us and then we'll see what happens. Because this is gonna be funny. Alright. Uh oh, I should trust this. I actually really want to trust this. You know what? Screw it, I'm gonna trust it. I'm gonna trust it. I'm doing it, because I trust it. That actually brought me where it wanted me to go. Oh, what's this? Fire resistance and a map. I assume fire resistance will be handy considering there's lava beneath us. Fireworks, I'd actually like to keep these. Why? Because I can use them to celebrate my victory when I've got the victory monument set up. All right, can we not stack these? No, okay. That's annoying. I'd like to stack them. Uh, a bottle of enchanting. That's definitely something I want, because now I can get that friggin' un unbreaking, whatever it was. Safety deposit box with iron chest plate, which we don't need. Potion of swiftness. I don't think I'm going to need this or this, so that's fine. I'll take any potions that we have, and I'll just see what to I can do. Really? All right, let's head upstairs, and let's see what's up here. There is one solitary... Frank Second Journal. We found them! We finally found the em emeralds! They're in the volcano thing, but they're everywhere. So many emeralds. We're only setting up our base at the top, but just digging into the wall gave us 50. We're culling for machinery and techie stuff soon. 
We've spent a week here, and the overseer says we haven't even scratched the suffice of what this volcano has in it. We're laying minecart tracks from each tunnel we make, but our emerald storage box are gonna be full soon. We got a crane! This is the best thing that has ever happened to me. I get to drive the crane if I'm good, I think, but the overseer didn't say that, but I really hope I can. Drove the crane for the first time. I knocked down a minecart line and the overseer took me out. I'm really sad, but it's hard to stay sad with all these emeralds. Been digging in here for another week and we're starting to send the emeralds back to our village. Expecting a shipment of drill parts soon. Drills came today. We set them up in the deepest tunnel we've made so far. We built a storage building down by where we're working for drill parts and other stuff. I'm being sent there to stay, so I have to leave this journal up here. Oh, Frank. I'm gonna keep your journal. Just because your journal is so interesting. So this is where Frank ended up. He ended up coming here. And that means that something has happened. Like, this area must be very important. Now, I'm gonna actually use these bots of enchanting, because I've got to keep inventory so I won't lose my levels. Which is... Uh, I've admitted this to you, Mapmaker, in, like, the very first episode where I commented on my post saying this, so... Okay, that's 21 levels. Uh, going down kind of terrifies me. I could just completely jump into the lot. Yo, you're a witch. You're a witch bitch. Where is she? Where's Rachel? What are you? Okay, custom mobs, custom minor mobs. Okay, interesting. wonder how much damage they do. Actually, I don't want to know, because... They're custom, and they're probably custom for this specific area, which means they're going to be tough. Oh Christ, oh Christ, this is going to be interesting. Oh God. Okay, I've killed one, but more come after me. That's going to be a problem. Right, let's go. Let's see if we can find this damn spawner that they're at. Okay, okay, I failed. I did not find the spawner. Okay, I'm going to find out how much they hurt now. Oh Christ. Nope, nothing, nothing, nothing. I'm too good, I'm too good. It's PvP, PvP, PvP master, 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 PvP. I do like how they're villagers. They're all villagers, which means that it makes more sense in the continuity of the villagers. And I saw the spawner. Oh, it's there, it's there, it's there, it's there. It's right there, you're getting in the way. Oh my god, you're getting in the way. You're getting in the way. Dude, get out of the way. Boom, done. I wonder if this is, uh, oh, more bottles of enchanting. I like that. Creeper, I do not like that. Watch out, watch out. Bye. Okay, I've got big potato. You're in a minecart. Why are you in a minecart? Why are you in a minecart, Mr. Creeper? No, Mr. Zombie, I mean. Really, no, be, be completely honest with me. I'd love to, to hear this. I'm gonna send you on your way. Bye. Oh, what a lovely place. They look so kind and... Screw you, screw you, screw you. Oh, Christ. Oh, there's more villager zombie guys. Okay, that's fine. I can deal with them. I don't know how long we've been recording for this less little episode for. Okay, if anything... Oh, you guys, I don't know how much damage you do. I still haven't checked. Like, you haven't hit me. Although I know what your spawner is now, because you freaking spawned. Oh god, you do a you do a bit of damage. Oh Christ. Oh god, you're gonna stack up, aren't you? Oh Christ, you really hurt. Oh god, get away, get away, get away, get away. Oh Christ, one of you just keeps spawning to get rid of the damn next one. Oh, died. Oh God, oh God, oh God, them two together, they really hurt. Where's their spawner? There it is, okay, got it. Do I have an arrow? I have an arrow. Oh, you're screwed. I have arrows now, guys, you're doomed. You're screwed, you're, you're not coming back from this. Oh, an emerald, lovely. Okay, nom nom nom. Potions! 
put you away for you. That's how I roll. Oh, is this a storage building? Huh. Nothing stored. Yeah. Yeah, man. Oh. Alright. Oh, hi. Yeah, hi. How are you doing? <laughs> He's kind of just like staring at each other, kind of waiting. That took a while to break for the cobweb. I wonder if it's because I was inside it. I've never heard of things taking that long to break through. Especially cobwebs. Oh, whatevs. We're almost at the bottom. Oh, okay, no, we're nowhere near the bottom, I can tell now. Okay. Doesn't look like there's any of... Oh, zombie miners again. I'm just going to call them zombie miners from this point on, because that's basically what they are. And the mobs with the really hard to find spawners. What's over here? Anything over here? Anything of interest? Oh, you're angry at. Oh, crap. Oh, God, you're angry. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Why did I go over there? No. No, 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 no. What's over here? Why are there zombie pigmen? Like, I don't understand. Okay. Dead end. Okay. Fine. That's a dead end. Okay, I'll leave you guys alone. Okay. Another emerald collection bin. No emeralds. Okay. But some potatoes that I don't think I'm going to need at this point. I've got way too many potatoes, but... I mean, like, obviously it never hurts to have more, but... At this point, I think I just have way too much. Where were you? Oh Christ, oh cr I'm dead, wow, that's weird. All right, we've been going on for 25 minutes, so I guess I will have to end off the episode here, but Christ, I didn't think I'd die that quickly. But hey, at least I know where the emeralds are and the red wall, which means the black wall is gonna be an Everdark Atlas. So we basically know where everything is, we just have to do it. So I also have levels now to enchant my stuff, so I'm gonna be doing that uh, during the break between this episode and the next. And I guess I'll see you next time, guys. So thanks so much for watching, and goodbye.